What is going on YouTube? Bringing you today a new series and it's going to be top five exercises. And the first one we're going to start off with is biceps. So as you can see on the screen, jumping into number five will be, well, this is my top five, by the way. I think uh, one of the best is the machine bicep preacher curl, simply because you can finish off with it so strongly, really burn the fibers out, push your muscle to failure, and it, your form's not going to really be uh, too influenced by, you know, pushing yourself to failure and things like that because you're locked in, your arms can't really move. All you'll do uh, if things get tough is like what you'll see I do is start swinging a little bit, leaning into it. But, I mean, you got to do what you got to do to push your arms just a little bit further to failure to make them grow. And, uh, yeah, that's number five. Jumping into the top four, number four will be if uh, some people may have not have done this exercise before because it's kind of a rare uh, bar to find. As you can see, it, it just mimics the rock hammer movement. It's a, uh, it's a bar that you can curl or do triceps with uh, straight up and down, hands close together, mimicking the rock hammer like I said. So if you don't have this bar, then just pick up some dumbbells and go for some normal rock hammer movement, uh, you know, standing curls. But I think this is a great exercise. One, because it brings up the brachialis really well and the forearms. And uh, you got to hit some of those movements with the wrist all the way up. Number three. One of the most staple exercises, in my opinion, for biceps is the cables. So you can switch out either the bar or... Or the rope, whichever one you prefer. Rope, again, because your hands are up, are going to hit more muscles that uh, the rock hammer that we just did before uh, will hit. But I prefer the bar simply because of the intense squeeze you get at the top. And you can also do some sick supersets when it comes to the cable and uh, you know drop sets, all that stuff to really burn the fibers out. Number two. This is one of my all-time favorites ever since I started doing it, and I only actually started doing it this year. Chris Jones, uh, you know, Pump Chasers showed me this. If you're familiar with the channel, I was watching a video on this. It is a incline seated dumbbell curl. Now, this is super, super good. One, because you're leaning back, so your arm never really releases any tension. It has, you know, force pulling on it the whole way down, and you can really get a nice squeeze. The other good thing about it is because you're locked into the chair or machine, whatever you want to call it, it uh, takes out the swinging movement that you can, you know, very easily do if you're standing up. So combining those two things together, the leaning and being in a seat, it uh, really helps you hit those fibers real nice. You can go quite heavy on this one. So overall, I think it is a very very great mass builder for the biceps. And finally, we have the number one best bicep exercise in my opinion. And it is, as you're about to see, easy curl uh, barbell curls. So you can, easy easy bar curls, sorry. Uh, so you can do this on the preacher machine. You can just see to the left of the screen. Or if you want to go a little bit heavier, you know, uh, let the body swing a little bit just to push the biceps to really move some heavy weight you can do them standing now if you notice with my hands i hold slightly uh to the inside of the bar to get that nicer squeeze at the top i think that is the number one exercise overall if i could pick any exercise that i wanted to do and could only do that exercise to grow my biceps it would be that one thank you so much for watching this video hope you stick around subscribe to the channel to see other top fives coming very soon and i will see you next time